welcome to Men's Life Roulette. Today in this video, we learn about the strategy about some outside bets. So these are the position which are outside the table. These are the six position and we are going to play our game with this six position alone. And the strategy is that we have to play with two position, any of the two position out of that six position. But one thing to remember, we will not play with red, with black, even with all and with a small number with big number so what actually we are going to do is that we will choose any of the two out of the six position suppose I choose the red one then I will definitely combine with red with odd or bigger number even or smaller number any of the two similarly when I go for a smaller number I may combine it with even with red with black or with odd so this is the strategy in this way we will uh, going to put our bets that means uh, when we are we are going to play with uh, 10 dollar basic bets we are going to play with 20 dollar for at every spin so two positions suppose i have chosen uh red with the smaller number then what will happen i will not lose at least on all the red number so with 18 red number i will not lose and also i will not lose with this 16 uh, 18 smaller number so where actually I will lose, I will lose at only the black number which are bigger. So nine number I have to lose and nine number I have to win. So the total winning and losing chances are nine number to win and nine plus zero that is a ten number to lose. So what is the benefit of losing with ten number and winning with nine number? There is a logic behind that and for that you have to uh, add one unit at both the position after every losses and you have to continue with the same high bets amount until you win or hit the target. So what should be the target? If you have a $1000 bankroll like this then your target should be $100. It's quite achievable and you have to play with $10 basic bets. So uh, let's start the game and see how it's actually give you the profit so I have chosen red with smaller number first and play so the strategy is if I lose then I have to add one unit at both position so it's not a lose not a profit so I'll just rebet or you may shift the position that doesn't matter because roll it is the game of random numbers so some if someone tells you that uh, I can predict the number then he must be lying so don't uh, believe to that system or the person who, who says that it's uh, quite easy to predict the number no it's not possible so this time I lose so I will go with even with bigger number this time but as I lose I just increase one more unit at both the position I have started the game from thousand dollar bankroll so my target is to achieve one thousand and one hundred dollar so Again, I lose here, so this time I am shifting my bets to smaller and uh, black, but this time with $30 unit, because earlier it was a $20 unit, this time I am going with a $30 unit. So, it's 10 and I win here. So, whenever you won, just remember, don't increase the bets. Stick to the same bets amount as the earlier one. And you may choose uh, to shift the position or go with the same position that your choice. But here I am decided to go with the same two position and play. Again, it's a smaller number and also a big black number. So again, I win here. So now I have decided to shift my position from black and bigger number instead of smaller number. And with same $30 unit at both the position. It's black but not a bigger number. So just no profit over here. But not loss also. So I, I will again go with the same bats with same arrangement and play. It's still again a black number but not a small, not a bigger number. So no profit here this time i have decided to go with the red and even number so same 30 dollar unit i will not increase or decrease anything until i 
hit the target or I lose. So it's red and a smaller number. So again, I a zero, no profit over here. So just rebats and play. You may shift your position from red to black, smaller to bigger. That depends upon your choice. So again, not a profit. So again, I just rebats and play. It's red, but it's not a smaller number this time, or not even number, so no profit. So now I have decided to go with the black and a smaller number with same 30 units or $30 this time also. It's red and a smaller number, but uh, don't give us any profit. So this time I have decided to go with the red and smaller number. So position doesn't matter. So you have to choose any of the two position, random position from the table. So this time I win here. So now you can see my bankroll. It's a 1,120. I have started the game with $1,000 and I have decided to go for a target of $100. So actually I achieved a profit of $120. So let's try again with the same strategy but uh, now we have to start from the beginning so I have decided to go with red with bigger number this time and play this time we have started from $1,120 and again our target is to achieve $100 so this time it's zero no profit so I just rebat and play if you have $1,000 bankroll and you are playing with $10 bets then it's quite achievable so this time also not a profit. So again just rebats and play. The strategy is to increase the bets upon your losses. So again if no profit over here. So just rebats and play. I will only increase the bets when I lose and I will only decrease my bets when I hit the target. So this time it's a winning number. So again, I, I decided to go with the same position. You might choose a different position after every spin. That doesn't matter as roulette is a game of chances and nobody won't knows which number will come. So this time also not a profit over here. So I, I have decided to go with, again with the same position and play. It's black and smaller number. So again, I lose here. So what I need to do is I have to increase my bets. This time I have decided to go with even and a bigger number with $20 this time at each position. It's a bigger number and black even number also. So this time I win here. So I just go with the same arrangement and play. In which places you are putting your bets is not important. So not a profit or not a losses over here. So this time I decided to go with red and smaller number with $20, same $20 as it was in the last spin. It's a bigger number and a black number so I lose here. So this time I have to increase the bets to 30 unit or $30 from $20 as I lose my last spin of $20 unit so it's a bigger number but not an even number so this time no any profit so this again just rebats and play in this way you can play with just outside bets any of the two outside bets so it's an even number again profit so just rebats and play you have to go with any of the two even number Oh, sorry outside numbers so this time I win here so I have decided to go again with the same management and play and remember every time you lose increase one unit at both the position so it's not a bigger number but a even number so no profit over here so again I will go with even number and smaller number with $30 unit It's a red number 
and also bigger numbers so i lose here so i have decided to go with the same arrangement and add one more unit to each position this is quite simple strategy it's five a smaller number but not the even number so again i just rebats and play it's 27 this time i lose so earlier it was a five four unit now i have to go with five unit this time and play so every time you lose just to increase one unit at both the position again i lose here so this time i will go with odd and smaller number with six unit this time For this strategy, having $1,000 bankroll is quite important. So again, I lose. So again, I will go with the or and bigger number this time with $7 unit at each position or $70. $1,000 bankroll is most for this strategy. So it's not a black number, though it's a bigger number. So I just rebats and play. it's 20 a bigger number and also a black number so it's a winning position so just rebats and play whenever you win just rebats and play whenever you don't lose anything just rebats and play so this time i win here so what i need to do is again i have decided to go with the same arrangement and play increase the bats only after you lose something and decrease the bets only after hitting the target so i lose my seven unit at each position so now i have decided to go with eight unit at uh, black and smaller number yeah it's just black and smaller number it's the profit over here so again the same arrangement and play Nobody knows which is the last color or the next color or the number will be. So going with the random bets is a solution for that. And increasing one unit after losses and uh, waiting for hitting the target of winning number is quite important. So again, just three bets and play as we don't lose anything in my last spin. It's 13, a black and a smaller number this time we won so now you can see the bank row it's uh 1280 we have played for this game for a profit target of 1220 but actually we make 280 dollars so in this few minutes of play within uh, this 10 or 20, 20 this 20 or 25 spin we lose so many spin and also win so many spin but finally we are we have achieved the target of $200. We played two sessions for $100 each, or we play for a target of $200, but we actually make a profit of $280. So this strategy is definitely a good strategy to apply. But the one condition is that you must have a bigger bank for like $1,000 when you are playing with the $10 basic bets. And the strategy is uh, you have to choose any two position from outside bets any of the two that doesn't matter which one you are choosing but you can't choose red with black or even with or like that and increase one unit after every losses and stick to that high amounts until you hit the target for every thousand dollar bankroll and ten dollar basic bets hundred dollars should be your target and it's quite achievable also in this strategy so I hope you like or understood this strategy and if you really like this strategy then please uh, like this video and subscribe my channel for more updates on roulette strategies which will prevent you from losing your money on roulette table thanks for watching thank you